Take a chance, you never know But you don't know it's beautiful Hey y'all, good morning, good afternoon, whatever you may be, whatever time it is, what's up? So, as you guys can see from to the, from the title, obviously, um, I'm gonna try and be about this vlog life for a few days. I don't know how good it's gonna be. Um, I really been wanting to incorporate vlogs into my channel, just wasn't sure like what and how. I really don't think I'm gonna be doing those like weekly vlogs, those week long vlogs, because I don't think my life is that interesting to be showing y'all what I do every day. <laughs> um, my life is very much routine-ish. Um, that's not even a word, but I pretty much do the same thing. I work, sleep, eat, do this, pretty much. So, um, but today is Tuesday. It is like a little after three. So I'm getting ready, getting my stuff together to record a video for tomorrow, for Wednesday. By the time this vlog go out, this video, that video will already be uploaded. Um, but that's what I'm getting ready to do. So I just went ahead and threw my hair up in a little bun. This is a headband wig from Beauty Forever. I have a review of it on my channel. Um, I just threw in a button. I didn't even put a headband on. You know, I can still see the whole straps and everything just because I'm going to be home. I'm sorry. I keep hitting my table. This is I'm going to be home, so it's no point. Um, but yeah, so I'm just about to go ahead and get ready. I always do my eyebrows off camera. Just because I feel like it makes the process go faster. But since I'm vlogging, I guess I'll do it right now. Just a little just a little tad bit. Just a little sneak peek. Because I said I was going to do like an actual eyebrow video. But I just never did it. What I use for my eyebrows, I use two products. Lately, I've been using this. I like this better. This is the um the MAC Eyebrow Styler. I don't know if y'all can see. I'm filming on my front facing camera. So I'm trying to get like the angles right. Um, The MAC eyebrow styler in the shade spike that's like a it's a brown um like the darkest brown or i'll use the anastasia beverly beverly hills like dip brown but with that i feel like it comes off very like ah like really it's really bold y'all my edges is white Ugh, i hate this i'm so sorry i'm gonna have to be very delicate because it's shaking the table <laughs> what is the k michelle um from love and hip hop oh it's shaking the table Y'all know what I'm talking about. My eyebrows are never shaped the same. This one always have a little bit more curve, but this one's always just like, bam, just straight out. try and get my top as like neat as possible because i don't really like filling in my top especially if i'm just doing my brows and that's it i don't like filling in my top because i don't like that residue around it i just do my bottom If I use my lighter concealer, then I'll go in with my actual, like, closer to my shade concealer and put it on my lid um, when it's time. So it's not like, it don't got to be light everywhere. Just just want to light up here. But that's it for right now because I don't want to save up. I don't want to give up all my tricks in the vlog. We got to wait until it's the actual video. Okay, y'all. So it is, like, close to 8. I told y'all I would check, back in, check in either before or after I recorded my video. Um... So my video is recorded. It is not the video that I had in mind. It is not what I had planned, but we had a hiccup. Y'all wanna know what my hiccup was? I went and recorded this entire video in slow-mo. And I didn't even break it, it's, didn't even know until after I got done, I wanted to go back and look at it and notice that it was in slow-mo. Like, I was so mad, I was so frustrated. I was literally in my bed almost in tears and then I got mad to the point, you know, you, you ever get mad, you get hot, you take deep breaths and like your foot <laughs> is tapping. That was me today. Getting to this lip combo though. Ooh, this one thing about that. I used the new primer today and I don't know if I like it. I don't know if it was too much down here or whatever, but it kind of like picked up the product and it won't, it, it was, first of all, it was hard for me to blend out everything. Literally hard for me to blend out my entire makeup. And now I got like these 
patches down here. I don't know what that's about. Tomorrow will be a better day. It'll be, a, fun, a I guess, a more adventurous day because we'll be out and about so you guys can see all of that. But right now, it's just like me chilling at home, doing what I got to do as far as like YouTube and whatnot. And most of the stuff that I do for YouTube is on my phone. So I can't really take y'all along with that type of stuff yet. But, you know, when I get a camera, y'all be able to see physically and whatnot what I do. But I just get into this lip. person in charge the one who's always been on top snacks destiny uh -huh. why i'm allergically reacting you know what destiny you look fine no i don't Come, I, I tell you and i promise puff, you look fine my puff is not as i promise you you look fine destiny you look fine you look fine anyways hello people it is what's today wednesday it's wednesday it is like almost five o'clock uh got dressed putting on a little raggedy we're well, not raggedy but like a little outfit we're getting ready to go run some errands and stuff or well, i'm going to get ready to go run some errands and stuff and my sisters are coming with me i apologize for the noise my siblings are acting crazy um but yeah it's wednesday and it's almost five o'clock so i'm uploading a video today and i'm trying to stick around for a little bit just so i can upload the video and um kind of be around for like comments and stuff like that for views so yeah this is the outfit for today. Got a headband wig on again, like I saw yesterday. Just did my brows and some mascara. My lashes used to be a lot longer than this, a lot thicker too. But life happened, I guess. I didn't see you yesterday. I didn't see you yesterday. I need to get like a little selfie ring light to put on my front facing camera when i'm in light like this yellow light so the white I light you do oh can i use it i'm not giving you three bucks mm -hmm. you buy me some juice while we out you can have apple juice i don't have i don't even drink apple juice well that's about the closest thing to juice you're gonna be getting oh i know daddy was here he just called the i hate driving in the snow that's why i didn't come out yesterday Dude, be careful. Don't slip. Welcome to Buffalo, guys. It's not like LA. It's uh, 50 degrees and cold outside. <laughs> or Atlanta. Or Dallas. 50 degrees not even cold. It's not, but then it is. So then it is. I hate, uh, it's like frozen. So I can't just like brush it off. It's literally just like frozen. Oh my God. I hate this stuff. Go conquer them all. What's it going really. to be? Something. Everybody needs somebody. Keep going. I don't know what's after that. <laughs> <laughs> I wish you could flip the camera yeah. while you record. No, you can't. So if I want to talk on us, I gotta stop it. It's okay.
Y'all, this is my favorite, like, spring, really? summer scent. Yeah, I love Pretty as a Peach. I like Black Cherry Merlot and um, Plum Prosecco. I always be saying Prosecco. Yeah. That's why I used to work here, so she know all the, the details yeah, about the scents. I didn't really like them. <laughs> why didn't you like them? She was annoying, and she was, like, I know, like, a parent, and I'm like... I don't know who you think you are. You're not. <laughs> you are not Pamela. In my life, take a, a couple notches. <laughs> what? Do it again. Do it. What? Do what? Yeah. <laughs> so, I'm trying to think. Like, I'm trying to think of like a scent that I smell that. What's that? You can smell that through the mask. Yeah. Your hands ashy, bro. Shut up. <laughs> this is supposed to be an in and out trip for her to return something, and we in here longer. We came. We saw. We conquered. We came. We saw. It took her forever, though. We tried. Yeah. Now we gotta go to the boulevard. And right. you used that 26 for food. What happened? You don't have that a receipt. I, I could have told you that, that you wasn't going to get your money back if you yeah, don't got a receipt. That's, uh, that's like common sense. I feel like to anybody. You go shopping, whatever. Unless you're in part of a program and I have to, where they I can pull your receipt up. Too. I just don't know what I'm See? That's where you messed up at. Well, when I had to move all the stuff on Christmas, I think maybe it got thrown off. I'm not really kidding. That's where you messed up. That's where you messed this up. Is what we came here for? Yes. Yeah. That's what came to this whole entire launch. Because she was supposed to. She was, yeah, she was supposed I to say something back too. Me. Bro, don't try to know when somebody, I don't I don't want to say, I don't know if it's hood language or whatever, but when somebody trying to say it's multiple things, they be like, it's, it's like whatever a pop. It's just like, yeah, it's not even street lingo. It's, it's like, like uh, not even slang, just like a brief. Right. If you want to say it's like 19 each or whatever, be like, it's, it's 19 it's a pop, like, it's 20 a pop. Yeah, basis. on a daily basis. It's just like, when it applies. Yes, it's when it applies. That's right. I feel like you should know this. All right, we got the boulevard. <laughs> a pop. <laughs> a pop, man. You put the impetus. Oh my god. <laughs> Low-key, I mean, I like athletic wear, especially during the summertime. Yeah, not this athletic wear. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> not athletic wear. <laughs> I don't like it. I don't like That's what that felt like her discount is for, homie. It's too you don't gotta come to dicks. I, like, I, to I, to I, I miss the little man. Yeah, I like, I miss the His sock is in my room. Aww. This is probably the worst park I've ever had in my life. Look at this. Because we were so far back and I didn't even know, I didn't even see. This is horrible. Girl, you did not ask to drive, first of all. I don't know if I trust you driving in the snow. Yourself, the way you just yeah, but a park is different than getting crashing. Right. And we're so far back, I probably I need doubt highly doubt anybody gonna be back here. Yeah, I'm horrible at this vlogging scene. Every store we go into, I stop filming. But now I'm just going inside of Walmart because I have a sweet tooth and I want to make stuff for banana pudding. So I'm about to go get some of the stuff for that and then we're going to go home because I'm starving. Okay, it's right here. Never mind. Okay, this one.
Everything is different. Who sweetened? Yeah, the sweetened, the sweetened milk, cream cheese. Blue cheese. Let me look. I need my phone. So I'm back home. I'm in my room. So I guess today was a little bit of a productive day, I guess. I mean, I didn't get up till close to three because I was up till like six o'clock in the morning. And simply because I work overnight, so I'm normally up all night um, on the days that I'm off and not sleeping late. So yeah, but it's nine o'clock now. We, so we went, we went to two malls for like quick runs or whatever. We went to the store, went and got food. So I went and got some pizza and some wings from this place called Remondos here in Buffalo. If you guys are from Buffalo and haven't heard of them, go check them out. I like their wings more than their pizza, but they still good. And they slices, it's three dollars a slice, but they slices are like big. I'm just about to eat. Um, I uploaded a video today and I forgot to add my tags and everything to it. So I must have go through my laptop and add my tags and stuff. I can kind of like show y'all what I use. Okay, so I'm about to show y'all what I mean when I was talking about like how I make tags and everything for my videos. If you're if you're if you're on YouTube and you're watching this and you're trying to figure out, I feel like this could be helpful but if not if you just watch me just to watch me i feel stiff like this could be helpful so you guys can understand you know what we go through and what we do as far as like getting our um videos view and search and all that other stuff so first and foremost so this is our channel dashboard um pretty much where we get all of our analytics and everything this is how we upload why is it not doing it moving this is how we upload our videos this is where we can see the performance of our videos and stuff like that so this is the video that I just released. Um, so I'm gonna click on content and then it'll show me in order all of the videos. No, I'm at this side. It'll show me in order, obviously, from all the videos that I made. Okay, so this is still processing in HD, but it's still being viewed because you can, as once your video gets uploaded in standard definition, it don't matter, it could hit YouTube but it can still be processing HD, 4K, all that other stuff. So it takes forever for my for my to do that for some reason. So for here, when we upload our videos, we have, this is where we put our title. Um, and then we have the description box. It's not moving. Okay, there we go. We have the description box. Um, this is where we type in anything that we want to be known as far as the video. If you guys pay attention to the description boxes, I always first type in, you know, what the video is going to be about. Sometimes I'll add physical hashtags. So if you go on YouTube and watch my video, these hashtags will be like under the video. Um, and then I'll add my social media or whatever. And if it's, some, if it's, if it's something as far as like clothes or makeup or whatever, it'll be longer than this because I'll put in detail, you know, the products and stuff like that. And then right here is tags youtube physically says that tags really doesn't make or break your video being searched but i don't know how true exactly that is because i've used tags and i feel like it helped with rankings of my videos and stuff like that so i feel like you can still use them just in case but pretty much the tags it's kind of like hashtags you put in just like tags a few words of pretty much what the video is the more the merrier but i think there's a five okay there's a 500 limit but i think once you get to a certain amount us of subscribers that this goes up because i'm pretty sure this used to be five thousand, or is the description box five thousand? Five thousand words okay the description box is five thousand okay so tags you only have 500 words um or letters per characters 500 characters that you can use to add tags so you want to be smart you want to get as much as you and but you still need to pay attention to this 500 limit um so you will add your tags in here my video is pretty much about talking about video um YouTube starting YouTube, so I'll just type in starting YouTube, and then with the app that I use to um to help you out with my search optimization, this as I'm typing stuff, they'll some of them will pop up. Pretty much some some of the stuff that's already been um related search topics or search terms as you type into something some search terms will pop up but if you just have if you don't have anything to help out i don't know they have they have other stuff but with the app that i use this is courtesy of the app this isn't um youtube affiliate like youtube related youtube affiliated youtube doesn't give you this so if, if i didn't have the app that i have connected to my dashboard to help me when it comes to me edit my videos this wouldn't pop up but since it's here it's like let me zoom in since it's there, you can see 
all the different topics and stuff that's related that's getting um searched right now so i'll add starting a youtube channel and then i'll add starting a youtube channel in 2021 and starting youtube channel tips like i'm definitely going to do more i'm sorry guys if y'all hear it talking about there i'm like my siblings be loud when they talk sometimes um but i'm going to add more than this but this is just a scenario an example of what the tags are so these certain tags will kind of like help when you type in whatever in a search bar the tags and the stuff in your description helps out with your video getting ranked being on the home page and getting views and stuff like that so that is one way and then with this google chrome plugin that i have to help me with my search engine optimization i'm going to go to actually youtube so i would recommend doing this step when it comes to you uploading your video because it helps so i already typed in how to start a youtube channel because that's similar this around the topic as far as like what that what my video that i just uploaded is about so you type that in and then right let me scroll up and then up here you obviously have the recommended videos now in this moment i am number four the fourth video and i'm only the fourth video in this moment because i watch my own video so if you watch my channel and you typed in something similar as to as to a video that um i have uploaded i'm going to pop up because you're familiar with my channel already like i went and had my sister look have had her sign off her youtube account and look and I wasn't, I wasn't number one. I was still on the homepage, but I was like further down. But because she watched my channel, I watched my channel, I pop up faster in the, more in the beginning than I would if somebody who don't watch my channel or isn't subscribed was to type in this topic, I would be further down. But the tests just help with you. You always want to be within the first, I would say you always want to be on the first page, but YouTube, I don't think they have pages anymore. You just scroll and keep going and keep going and keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going which I highly don't. I mean, sometimes I do depending on if I just want to look and look and look. See, uh, some of this stuff down here is not even about to make sense. But if I just want to look and look and look, sometimes I'll go all the way down here. But nine times in 10, the average viewer is not going to keep going all the way down to the bottom. So you want to be as high up as you possibly can within the first five or whatever. And that all helps with your search engine optimiza optimization um, and then once you start getting views and stuff like that, like she has 2 million views. So she's at the top because I'm pretty sure her search engine stuff is great, but she also has 2 million views. So she has the most viewed video about this topic. And then Think Media um, has the second most viewed. But like I said, Catherine Manning, Think Media, and Sean Cannon are great to influencers, content creators when it comes to YouTube tips and tips and tricks. They are, they are perfect people for that. Because she has the most views, I'm going to see, okay, what was her tags and stuff look like? So I'm going to click on her video. I'm going to pause it because I don't really want to watch it. Um, not saying I don't want to watch it, but in this moment, I don't need to watch it. I just want to show you guys what I'm talking about. So over here is stuff, again, that I have because of my search engine optimization. So I can see a lot of things when it turns to this video and her success and stuff with it. It tells me, it pretty much let me know the ins and outs, the analytics of her specific video. Again, she has 2 million views. So not saying I'm going to get 2 million views, but I want to see what it is it that she did differently or that she used that I can like kind of take to help with my video performance. So it tells you the amount of views that she has. It tells you the amount of comments that she got. You know, you can see that down there. But then it tells you the likes versus dislikes. And then as far as like SEO. So I think creator suggested means like if another YouTube um, YouTuber suggested her video. But I think that's what it means. But then right here you see overall she has an SEO score of 95. So right here we have tags. So again, that's what I'm trying to add to my video. I'm trying to add tags. She has 2 million views. So I'm going to see what her tags are. So she has the contact bug, which was originally her platform name. How to start a YouTube channel, I have that. How to grow on YouTube. How to start a successful YouTube channel. How to start a YouTube channel in 2020, which was the time of the video. How to start a YouTube channel in 2020 again. She has that twice. Oh, in 2020. And then this one just says YouTube channel 2020. Again, the slight word difference can change, can matter. Like somebody can be searching more YouTube channel 2020 than versus YouTube channel in 2020. And that can make a difference as far as where your video lands on the front page. Now I can copy the tags that she has. I'm going to do copy to clipboard. 
then I'm going back to my YouTube studio. I'm just going to paste the tags that she used. And then I can go through and take off which ones I don't. So it's pretty much just like a little cheat sheet to kind of just help. Like if you're not sure what tags to use, you can go search the video and see what is it that the person with the best views used to get, you know, where they were, whatever, what were their tags. Okay, y'all, so I finished everything that I had to do as far as the video. I had the video running just to help with, like, my watch time and stuff like that. Um, But, yeah, so after everything I showed y'all, the SEO score is at 100, which is what we want. We want it to be up in the green. You don't got to be 100 at the dot. We want it to be at the green. When I first did it, it was at 70, and I was like, 70? What in the world? So I went and looked at it. Um, to They have... The option right here, SEO score with a little edit joint. I clicked on it and it showed me some stuff that they feel like they, they I should change. So I went ahead and changed those things. And now I'm at 100. So that's good. Hopefully, um, you know, I'll get some good views, get some, you know, get ranked or whatever with it. But that is just my process of when it comes to uploading my video and what I do as far as like my search engine tools and stuff like that. So I hope that was a little bit helpful. I know some of y'all, I was probably talking English, English spanish <laughs> what in the world days y'all already speak english um i was probably talking foreign but for those of you who do come across my video and willing to get some insight or just to you know okay well this okay cool now i know a little bit of how she what she do or if you're new or on youtube and trying to figure out more ways to grow and stuff like that this is just one of my tips so again i would highly suggest we're going and subscribing to katherine manning and sean candle think media i will leave their stuff either in the description box or on um, the screen of the video just so you guys can take a look at them if you guys need more helpful tips and stuff like that as far as um youtube itself take a chance you never know but you don't know if you